Hi, this is Krishna Merchant and thank you for joining us uh, for the equity market uh, roundup uh, after the budget speech. The Sensex is down around 109 points at 19,045 at around 1.30 p.m. The markets may have not reacted very well to some announcements during the budget, especially the increase in corporate surcharge uh, from uh, 5 to 10 percent for companies with um, taxable income of more than 10 crore and also the hike in the dividend distribution surcharge. Also, the finance minister said that for an institutional investors that were holding 10 percent in any company would be classified as FDI. We need to see the impact on the market uh, of that announcement. Also, uh, there was no hike in the excise duty or rather the import duty on gold, uh, which helped uh, some of the consumer durable stocks. Um, um, for example, Titan Industries and Gitanjali uh, gems were up around 6% each. Also, auto stocks uh, declined following the announcement that SUVs, the excise duty would be increased to 30%. Mahindra and Mahindra fell around 0.5% and Tata Motors was down around 0.2% uh, at 1.30 p.m. Excise duty on cigarette uh, went up to 18%. Uh, ITC, uh, the cigarette maker ITC did not react much. Uh, the stock was up around 2%. Also, uh, from the textile space, Arvind Mills and Rajesh exports were up around 3%. This is following the announcement that the technology up upgradation scheme will continue and there would be 0% excise duty uh, route for uh, the cotton and spawn yarn at uh, the fabric uh, or the garment level. BSE Realty Index uh, rea reacted positively. Uh, some of the stocks were up. For example, Sobha Developers was up 5% and Anantraj Industries gained 3% and DLF was up 1% following announcement that there would be 1% TDS on uh, transactions above 50 lakh on immovable property and also affordable housing interest uh, deduction by 1 lakh for loans up to 25 lakh. Uh, these are the stocks which reacted uh, right after the budget. Do stay tuned to livemint.com to get more updates. That is all for now.